when flooding happens, the first thing you'll probably see is the parking lot gets overflowed and it runs right off into the area. And as you see that flood hits the houses in the lower end, sometimes it seeps off. I've heard families tell me that they've seen their houses in the open ocean before. Wetlands are ways of controlling flooding, kind of like a natural sponge. They soak up stormwater, slow down runoff, and filter pollutants. When cities take care of their wetlands, it not only keeps neighborhoods safer from floods, but can also support cleaner water and more wildlife. And we also know with wetlands, you see some of the garbage that are around there. We always tell people the best thing you can do is make sure if you see it, maybe try to clean it up. One of the things we think about is retention ponds. So retention ponds are man-made depressions that permanently hold stormwater and releases it slowly to reduce flooding. So in this model, you can see how water flows a slower, clearer path than it would if landing straight on concrete, also known as impervious surfaces. These ponds are often built near a parking lot or a school district to manage large volumes of runoff, 